Ukraine standoff, a new way to edit DNA, and rethinking gentrification. Good afternoon. This is the New York Times Minute. Further divisions today in Ukraine's Crimean Peninsula. The pro-Russia prime minister of Crimea says numerous Ukrainian military units have surrendered, moving the peninsula closer to the independence it seeks from Kiev. Meanwhile, fast-moving diplomatic moves, with John Kerry pledging $1 billion and Russia's Vladimir Putin saying, From our science desk, a new way to edit DNA. Scientists discovered that an enzyme, shown here in blue and gray, can cut DNA, shown in gold, in specific places. The technique hasn't been used in humans yet, but it could conceivably fix the genetic mutations that cause diseases like cystic fibrosis. Clearly, it adds to the ethical debate over designer babies. And after years of courting young professionals, American cities are now working to protect the lower middle class homeowners, threatened by gentrification. The prize for toughing it out in once rough neighborhoods? In Philadelphia and Boston, it could be reduced or even frozen property taxes.